Hey everyone, this is Dhruvin and I come up with another step by step series for Power Virtual Agents and Q&A Maker. During this entire series, we will be talking about how we can integrate Power Virtual Agents with Q&A Maker. We are going to build one Q&A type of chatbot or we can say that as FAQ chatbot with the help of Power Virtual Agents and Q&A Maker. So stay tuned throughout this entire session. During this first session, I am going to give you the course outline for this entire series. But before we do that, let me give you a little bit introduction about me. Myself Dhruvin Shah and I am working as Power Platform Specialist or Microsoft 365 developer in one of the reputed company at Gujarat, India. I am a very active blogger and YouTuber having published 120 plus articles on C Sharp Corner and 450 plus tech videos on my YouTube channel. This is the link for my social media handles detail. You just need to click on this link. This will be redirecting you to this particular page where you can follow me on my YouTube, LinkedIn, blogs, Twitter, Facebook and GitHub repository. And if you need more further assistance, then you can email me at dhruvinsha16 at gmail.com. That is the email address. Now, without wasting much time, let's get started with the course outline. Now, the first question arises in your mind that what are the prerequisites before you get started with this particular course? I personally believe that you have a simple knowledge of Power Virtual Agents. And if you don't have... I have provided the link in the description box where I have prepared entire step by step series for Power Virtual Agent where I have explained different terminology and we have built one step by step simple chatbot over there. So I hope uh, you have a basic idea about Power Virtual Agent's chatbot before you get started with this one. Now in this course we can first build a QA maker. So basically in QA maker we'll need to build knowledge base for our QA maker. So in the first part we will be talking about how we can build knowledge base with QA maker for PVA. Now in the second step we are going to build our QA or FAQ chatbot for HR with Power Virtual Agents. So we will be getting started by building step by step Power Virtual Agent chatbot. So this is similar like the step by step series but here we will be do some fast forward process. In the third part we will be talking about system fallback topic in Power Virtual Agents. So this is something which is a concept learning about system fallback. What is system fallback and how it is useful and how we can utilize in the chatbot. We will be talking more about that thing in detail over here. In the fourth part what we are going to do is we will be connect our Power Virtual Agents chatbot with QA Maker using Power Automate. So we are going to build one flow which will call our QA Maker from Power Virtual Agents to get response from the QA knowledge base. In the fifth part we will be building the rest of the part of the chatbot that we have started in the second part of this series and we will be publishing and testing our QA or FAQ chatbot in detail in this session. And in the sixth part what we are going to build is let's say if we enter any question to our chatbot and if the chatbot is unable to answer that time we will be storing that question into our future reference so we will add those question in future to update our knowledge base so we will be talking about how we can track unanswered question from pva and update our knowledge base to improve pva so this is the last part of the series one important thing that at this moment this entire series only have six part but in future let's say if i have received any request from you in the comment section about any scenarios and I will prepare any video I will add that to the same playlist of PVA and QA maker. So make sure that you will bookmark this particular playlist. So whenever I upload any new videos related PVA and QA maker that will be appended to this playlist and it will be handy available. Now this is the theoretical portion that we have talked about. Now let me talk about what we are going to actually build throughout the session. I am going to give you the demo and then you will be realizing that if that is useful to you or not.
so basically i am going to build one hr chatbot over here so basically i have one word document with all frequently asked question for hr this is my faq word document now what i did here is i uploaded that word document to my, to my qna maker in order to train my model and in order to prepare my knowledge base over here so basically i prepared uh, this qna over here at the one place and then what i have done is i connected my knowledge base with my power virtual agent chatbot now let me give you the demonstration of my chatbot let's say i am entering hi then in response it will allow me to ask a question i am just asking a question like how many leaves can i take so it will ask the same question to my knowledge base and connect there and based on that it will answer me like this now it is asking that did that answer your question so i am just pressing yes so it will ask me for review so i just reviewed that thing and now it is asking that can i help with anything else and we will press yes now i am entering a question which is not a part of knowledge base like like this what does clo stand for so it is printing like sorry i didn't understand can i help with anything else and we can press no thanks now let's say this is the unanswered question from my chatbot so what we will do is we will track unanswered question from this pva and update the knowledge base to improve the power virtual agents in future so we will be talking about that in the sixth part of this session so this is the overall agenda that we are going to perform throughout this entire six series of pva and qna maker integration so this is something that we are going to build from scratch to end so stay tuned to my next session in my next session we are going to build our knowledge base with qna maker so see you in the next session of this series if you are for the first time to my channel make sure you hit subscribe and press the bell notification to never miss any updates from my channel stay tuned with me on facebook linkedin twitter also here i am uploading daily video on power bi power apps power automate power virtual agents teams and sharepoint so don't forget to subscribe me also if you wish to receive the daily notification about all my new updates that i am uploading on the youtube you just need to click on this particular get whatsapp update icon that will be redirecting you to this form fill the form and you will be receiving all the new updates of my video on your whatsapp number also if you wish to listen different podcast trailer power platform just click on that it will be redirecting you to my podcast home page where you can listen your favorite power platform related podcast from your favorite podcast platform like apple podcast google podcast spotify and much more one important thing if you wish to increase your knowledge into power platform and want to learn different power platform advanced concept just go to the playlist section from here from here just filtered by created playlist here you will be finding the different playlist for ai mix reality power apps power automate power bi and much more so you can visit your favorite playlist from here and increase your knowledge this is thruvin signing off have a great day goodbye